Over the last 10 years, the Department of Radiology at the University of Florida College of Medicine has conducted a simulation-based evaluation of radiology resident competence and critical care imaging. 197 residents interpreted this case of emphysematous pyelonephritis as one of 65 cases during an 8-hour simulated on-call shift with a median score of 1 out of 10 and an overall average score of 4.21 out of 10. Overall, the average number of points lost out of 10 to observational discipline was 2.79. At the same time, 2.9 points were lost due to interpretive errors on the part of the residents. We define an effective report to be one which achieves scores between 7 and 10. In terms of letter grades, this would be an A or a B. In this most missed case, 39% of residents produced effective reports. We define report having a critical error to be one with scores between 0 and 2. In terms of letter grades, this would be an F or a D. In this most missed case, 59% of residents produce reports with critical errors. This is an ultrasound on a 59-year-old with diabetes, fever, sepsis, and right flank pain. The ultrasound demonstrates multiple hyperechoic regions within the renal parenchyma. The largest area is at the superior pole, and you'll notice that you see dirty shadowing extending from this area also from other areas, but this largest area in the superior pole. These findings are compatible with emphysematous pyelonephritis. The echogenic area is the air, and the dirty shadowing is created by the air. You're really not going to get this appearance with other uh, pathologic processes. On the flow images, you can see there's no altered flow to the kidney and there's no hydronephrosis. This would be an urgent finding level four and this could be more completely characterized with a CT to better define where this air is tracking. The only additional other finding that could have been mentioned was a gallstone in a contracted gallbladder. So the urgent finding here is the emphysematous pyelonephritis.